Business cases. What do you need to know about a business case? Well, before any project gets started, there needs to be some type of justification. Some type of analysis on how much are we going to spend on the project versus how much is it going to benefit our organization. Part of doing that business case is understanding what the driver is for the project. Is it a social need? Is it compliance or regulatory? Is it a custom or request? That all plays into this business case. Now, typically, the sponsor is going to also look at some financial metrics. Those financial metrics could be things like calculating net present value, internal rate of return, maybe doing a return on investment analysis. So you want to see typically financials in that business case. Again, this is the justification for the project. Now, your role in this as project manager really comes to play when your project is moving along and you're evaluating how well you're progressing against your baselines. So let me walk you through an example. Let's say I'm doing a project that was a customer request project. I look at the business case and it shows that we're going to make some money on this. We've got a good profit margin. I'm looking at that net pre present value and it's positive. But I look at my forecast and I see, boy, this project is going to come in way over budget. Well, that affects then the justification. I'm going to want to have a conversation with the sponsor about that. Take a different scenario. Let's say that you're running a project that's compliance or regulatory. It's a must do. We all love those projects, don't we? We've got to get it done no matter what. I'm not going to be as focused on that NPV because most likely it's got a negative NPV because we're not making money off the project. It's just a must do. So think about that business case as being kind of that guiding light throughout your project. Now, one thing I'm a big fan of on projects, especially longer projects, is having some type of phase gate or periodic reviews where we evaluate our project and say, okay, based on where we're at today in our forecast, and what that information is that's in that business case, does it make sense for this project to proceed or not? It's amazing to me how many organizations continue to throw money and resources at projects that are never going to succeed or yield the benefit that we anticipated at the start. So we want that periodic checkpoint. Now, of course, at the end of your project, you also want to check in one more time what did we say we were going to make on this project? Did we make it? Are we getting the return we expected? That information then feeds into your lessons learned report. I'm Belinda Goodrich from PM Learning Solutions, and our topic today was the business case.